Hey everybody, it's Brittany. Um, so yesterday I took my hamsters to the pet spot, and they are both girls, which I'm thankful. Um, so I don't have to worry about babies and having to separate them at all right now, um, and whatnot. But yeah, so yeah, but uh, they're sleeping, as you can tell. Um, so yeah. Makes you just want to hold them. You know? I mean, they are very adorable. Hello, boobies. Um, so their names are officially with no question or anything their names is Gabrielle and Zena um and everything so I don't have to worry about renaming them or or anything uh, so I, f I feel very relieved and everything so yeah I think what these little ones have compiled is since they have this tubing they've made bedding going through it so, I don't know. It would be cool to, like, make it an underground railroad for them. I might end up trying doing that when I clean out the cage. Um, when I do clean the cage and stuff. I think I'll make them, like, an underground railroad tunnel type thing. Because I know they like to burrow. And I might do that with all my hamsters. Hamsters cages. And stuff, so. To give them, you know, a secret way to, you know, sleep and, and whatnot. So, yeah, I think it'd be cool. Um, ah, oh man, I was at the pet store yesterday. They, the one I went to, they sell males, and that's where I got Zarek and Zeno. And they had a pure white Robo Dwarf hamster, and I was like, oh, I wish I could get it. But then if I get another male hamster, it would require another cage and stuff. So I, I wasn't able to get it. But, um, maybe next time. So. Look at their little feet and little nails. They're very tiny. They're very fast little craters. Um. And stuff, so. Uh. Are you guys chewing on the bedding? They have very weird whiskers. Um, but they're not fighting. Um, I think they play fight, but, um, you know, just doing that little, I'll say little boxing stuff, I guess. I don't know. And then they chase around, each other around and whatnot, but, I mean, so far I haven't heard any squealing or crying or anything or haven't seen any of uh, blood, so. Yep. So as far as I know, they get along, and from what I see, they get along, so. But, yeah. I'm afraid to pet them. Uh, I'm afraid I, you know, I'll accidentally startle them, and then they'll, like, bite me and stuff. I think the only way I would ho I hold them is if I get them in the ball, and then they crawl onto my hands and stuff, so. Yeah. Um, but so far, it, every one of them is doing good, healthy, <clears throat> very active, and everything. So it's it's going good. So these are my little girls. I have three boy pets and. Eight girls. Oh no, seven girls. Because I have ten animals. Because I have a male dog and two male hamsters. And then three female cats, two female hamsters, and one rabbit female. And one female dog. If I haven't said that yet. Um, so, yeah, I have three boys, and the rest of my animals are all girls. Um, so. But 
I think tomorrow will be the day I clean the cage. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, doesn't look too bad. So. Ain't that right, ladies? But anyway, I'm going to cut this sh this video now, so um, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and, uh, and uh, stay tuned for more ha hamster videos, whether it be of Zeno, Zarek, Zeno, or Gabriel, or all of them. I've done a couple of videos, just have to upload them. Sometimes my laptop doesn't quite work, so I do it from my phone, so it makes the videos a little bit smaller in size, but not the length, really. Um, but anyway, so yeah, just please rate, comment, subscribe, and, uh, if you guys want to know anything about Robos, specifically, you know, you can search Robo Dwarf Hamsters, do research up on them, and if you guys want to know anything about my four little hamsters, just ask. Um, so, yeah, say bye-bye, baby. Oh, she's gonna eat. <laughs> she must have been stuff storing some stuff in her sockets, her little cheek pop patches. But, um, we'll catch you guys later. Bye.